pump step your game up Sire Records DX My uh, soul Don't forget to Ele do mari fumi ni money Go le ki ma go mo mi yo Come on Jojo Olinyo I like to wale energy plenty My happy students, uh, today we are back to class again, financial accounting for SS1, and we will be our seminar. And uh, yesterday, the other day I introduced the book of Jonah, and it is continuing because it has not finished. So today we are using, we are looking at the use of Jonah continued, and uh, the topic that is going to be recorded today is the purchase of business. You know, in the accounting practice, the cash book is used to record all transactions for which cash you are paid. The purchases day book is used to record all transactions that the web books you have bought on credit and for itself. Also, the sales day book is used to record all goods sold on credit. But then, if somebody sells or buys a business entity, in which book will be recorded? It is not possible to be recorded in the cash book, or in the purchases book, or in the sales book. The book to be recorded into in which it should be recorded is called the journal. And the journal is one of the books of original entry, as we told you before, which contains all the transactions that cannot be comfortably recorded in other books of account. But this did not say that journal cannot be used to record cash transactions. Journal can be recorded, it can contain both transactions, credit and, uh, and purchases. And even the purchases day book, which is made on credit, can as well be recorded in the journal. The same thing applies to sales and all the transactions in the cash book. All can be contained in one journal. That's why a journal becomes the only uh, book of original entry in which the, 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 all the items, including those that cannot be comfortably recorded in other books of account, are recorded. First, we have purchase of business. One man, a man may decide to, a businessman may decide to sell his business on retirement, or his family may decide to sell the business entity at his debt, and so on and so forth, and somebody else bought it. That person may not, in short, cannot record it in the cash book. Whether he paid cash or he, paid, he bought it on credit, he will record it in the journal, that's the first port of call. And after that, he can now record cash book or other cash transactions for the year. And this is what we are here to show today. For example, now, purchase of business should be recorded in the book of journal. Purchase of business should first be recorded in the journal. Look at that illustration. On the first November, S. Ikem bought or acquired a business of D. Eden and took over the following assets and liabilities. Yes, what you sell in the business entity is assets and liabilities. The assets include the buildings, the furniture, even name them, and as well as acquiring the debtors and the liabilities, the creditors. So what it means is that if a person buys a business, the person will as well buy the liability in where those the business was owing, and as well as collect the debts which we are put in the business before the acquisition. So on that ground, this one now shows that the business entity of Eden contains building 3,609 uh, in those days, furniture and fitted 249, and then stock 5,000. Then creditors, those who was owing 
for a company, was running a company called CFAO. It was running them 629. So show the show this uh, transaction as it would appear in the book of S and look at it. The journal to which this type of business shall be recorded is called opening journal. So on this show, like I said, our our our, our Luther has been editing and creating. Account is all about editing and creating and not note cutting. Here now the journal is a bit of credit. The building is an asset, it's always on the debit of the ledger. Furniture is an asset, always on the debit side of the ledger. Stock is an asset, it's always on the debit side of the ledger. Then creditors is a, a, a credit entry, that's why it is on the credit. Then the person who sold business is called the vendor, and it is Mr. B. Eden. This is the difference. Between this and 620, it gives you 820, and that is a capital. That is how it is considered. Now, you will do the, the other day, I use this journal to do correction of errors. The other day, we used journal to do correction of errors. And another one today is the purchase of business. And we have done it now. From, I think we have finished everything about the use of journal. You are going to solve Number one of the eight order one um, page 143 and pass it for marking. Remember, we are going to do tests on this subject in the nearest future. We will tell you, maybe you have been informed. Bye for now. Keep fit. Thank you. Step, 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 pump, step the game up. Zyra Records. DX. My power. I'm finna do my fumi money. Go on, let's keep my gold.